that man-made flap prevents acid from coming out of the stomach. We're all used to firefighters risking their lives to save another, and that's true even if the victim has four legs. In today's Hero Central, 11 Lives Jay Watson shows us how Forsyth firefighters repelled 35 feet down a well to pluck a victim to safety. There's no question it's easier here inside the garage for Forsyth County's fire rescue than it was on Doc Bramblett Road last week. Last Wednesday, down, down beneath Forsyth County soil, something was trying to stay alive. We will risk a lot mm -hmm. to save a lot. Mm -hmm. Lieutenant Zach Basil and his men found themselves huddled around a well, staring at a dog that had fallen 35 feet below, barking furiously, treading water, struggling to somehow stay alive. A couple of times it stopped barking and I was concerned that it had gone ahead and given up. One line for me and there'll be a second line for my safety with the callable lay line. This is Keith Perchy in the harness today. This was Keith Perchy in the harness a week ago, lowering himself into ice cold water down a well barely wider than his chest. It's, 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 it's pretty tight. Uh, some things go through your mind a little bit here saying, oh, gee, I hope these guys get me back out. But, you know, we trust each other and uh, we trust our equipment. We trust our training. When Keith got to the bottom. What he found was surprising. Neck deep, Lucy was calm, dog paddling for who knows how long. And then after what must have felt like an eternity, out of a two and a half foot hole, she sprang, wet, cold and scared. Some scrapes on her nose and paws but safe. When that dog came up out of that hole and you could see his face, you know, it all, it all came good. That's what makes it worthwhile. Jay Watson, 11 Alive News. And Chesley has a last look at the forecast in about two minutes. Eleven Alive's Hero Central, extraordinary stories of local heroes. Brought to you by Motlick & Associates Attorneys, helping accident victims since 1984. When I was in an accident, I spoke with the insurance company for help. When Marge Henderson reached out to us for help, we were genuinely concerned. I needed money for my medical bills and lost income. We were concerned about paying her too much money. <laughs> the insurance company figured I wouldn't get a lawyer. So we offered her a lowball settlement. They really stuck it to me. Thanks, insurance company. You're welcome, Marge Henderson. Protect your rights. Call Mollick & Associates at 1-800-LAW-NEED. On the next Dr. Oz Show, Dr. Oz hits the streets to expose hidden reasons.